my name is Susanna and I'm here partnering with The Kitchen is My Playground to bring you this recipe for broccoli rice casserole today. Now this recipe is a great one to have for holidays, really any holiday, Easter, Thanksgiving, Christmas, any time of year, Memorial Day coming up pretty soon, a great side for that. It's great for potlucks or even just your everyday weeknight dinner. Um, we're actually probably going to have it alongside some rotisserie chicken tonight, so it's very easy to whip together and then, you know, you have a meal that has required very little effort. Um, now, broccoli rice casserole is also usually a big hit with everyone, kind of a crowd pleaser. Um, if you're like me and have kids at home who are a little picky eating, um, broccoli they love, cheese they love, rice they love, so you just can't go wrong with it. Now, we're going to start off today by adding our rice. We have some cooked rice here. We're just going to add this to our bowl. We've got all our ingredients out, and as you can see, it doesn't take that much, and these are all items you probably already have in your house. Uh, we've got some chopped onion, just very finely chopped, very tiny little pieces, mixed in nicely. We are also going to have a can of cream of mushroom soup. Add that into. And we've got some milk. And in this little bowl here, we've got a few dry seasonings. We just have um, salt, black pepper, garlic powder, and paprika. They add a lot of flavor. We're also going to add some cheese. Anything with cheese is good. Can't go wrong with that. Right. And you'll mix all of this together. It's all mixed up here. We're just going to add our chopped broccoli now. And, and just fold that in gently. You don't want to break the broccoli up too much. So just be very gentle folding it in. But make sure it is incorporated well. We have um, some cooking spray and just a 9 by 13 glass dish here. That's covered. And then you just spoon the mixture into the pan. Okay. Once you've got the casserole in the dish, you're going to top it off with some cheese. Make sure everything is fully covered, cheesiness in every bite. It's ready to go in the oven, and then when it comes out, if you have you know, some chicken on the side, or sandwiches, some barbecue, whatever you've got going with it, your whole meal is ready. So I'm just going to pop this in the oven, and then we'll take a look at it when it comes back out. All right, y'all, our broccoli rice casserole has come out of the oven. Hopefully you can see it. Look how delicious that is. So much cheesiness on top. It is that kind of golden brown color. It was a little bubbly when I first pulled it out of the oven. Just let it set for a minute to cool. And then you're gonna plate it and see what that looks like. It smells amazing. I wish you could smell like through the video because the whole kitchen smells fabulous now. All right, we are just gonna cut a little serving here. Let's see what this comes out like. There it is. I don't know if you can see. You've got your broccoli. It plates very nicely. You see the rice. All of it holds together so well. All those ingredients just keep it nice and compact. It's not like one of those casseroles that just kind of goes everywhere. Um, and you've got those extra spices in it to give it a little extra flavor as well. So you've got the recipe now. You've seen how easy it is to make. Make sure you follow the link to their blog and get the full recipe and make it for dinner tonight or set it aside for your next holiday gathering. I hope you all enjoy.